Hey, what's up guys, Shom here and today in this video, I'm going to show you how to increase the clock time speed of the processor in your Android smartphone. So, let's get started. Yo guys, so this is my rooted device and as you can see, it's a Geoni P3. Let me focus on the logo. Okay, as you can see, it's a Geoni P3 device and I always use this device to make tutorials on rooted phones. Okay, so let's get started and overclock this device. Okay. So in order to do this, what you have to do is you have to download an application. I'll give you the links for that application in the description for free. Okay. So I already done that and I'll just put it in my internal storage. As you can see here, it says the old clocking application. So I'll put on that and I'll just install it. Okay. The name of the application is Set CPU. Okay. So let's install. Yeah, it's done. Okay, now the application is installed, so let's get started and open the application, which is, let me just, yeah, okay, so here's the application, set CPU, so let's tap on that, and what it asks is, uh, make sure you have SSF, okay, continue recommended, okay, so let's continue, and uh, yeah, okay, so it will ask you for the root permission, as you can see, super ASU permission, and I will give it permission, grant the permission, Okay, and your setting has been saved. Okay, the actual meaning is uh, this CPU has 1.3 gigahertz as its uh, uh, default. Uh, what do you say? Clock time speed. And this application, what it does is it used to make your processor forced to work on its highest uh, clock time speed, which means if your processor is 1.5 gigahertz, uh, this device can force it to run on 1.5 gigahertz at all time. Uh, which leads to um, draining of your battery uh, pretty fast make your device heat very fast so it has uh, some negative impacts uh, but but it can help you making your device run faster okay so let's set on boot okay okay let me just reboot this device and I hope it will do that so let's reboot it Now let's uh, just download our. Okay, we already have CPUs that application, and let's see uh, what is the current CPU status. Okay, oh my God, as you can see here, CPU zero one. Okay, it has it is a quad core CPU, and all the CPU is running on its highest level. As you can see here, the clock time speed of this uh, uh, p 3 processor has 1.3 gigahertz. And don't get confused from this Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 800 chipset. This device does not have that. Um, why this is coming? Because of the custom ROM, which is the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. So because of that, it's coming. But on real, it has 1.3 GHz processor, which is a very normal processor. I think a MediaTek processor. So uh, don't get confused from this architecture. This is just a fake architecture. Okay. So yeah, this application really works uh, to its real hardware functions. That's it guys and if you have any questions please ask me in the YouTube comment sections and I will really help you guys. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please hit that like button and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye guys. Peace.